How to generate images with chat GPT. So I'm sure you've seen online the incredible pictures generated by AI and you want to learn how to do it yourself. Unfortunately, you can't do it all within chat GPT. You will need to go to Midjourney for this. So the website is midjourney.com. I recommend logging into your Discord first before you do this because you will need to click join the beta and that's actually going to be going on within Discord. So you need to click accept invite there. You might have to log in or create an account if you don't have a Discord already. But once you're on Discord, you want to go to the server. Then you want to make sure you specifically go to one of the newbie servers. Then you can go ahead and paste in the text prompt, which you're going to get from ChatGPT in a second. So what you're going to want to do, uh, the ChatGPT's role within this is creating the text prompt. So what you want to type into ChatGPT is create a mid journey text prompt for them whatever it is so for this example i'm going to say a uh, cool new football club badge and then you'll see that the ai is going to generate the text prompt for it so that's the role within it you're not going to get the picture within here you're just going to get the text prompt which you're going to put into the discord server with mid journey so as you can see it's generated there all you need to do is go ahead and copy that uh, text prompt there and then you'll want to paste it within Discord. But before you do that, you want to type in forward slash imagine. And then uh, you go ahead and click that there. And then within this little section here, you want to paste that text prompt. And then just go ahead and click search. Then it will go ahead and generate it for you. It might take uh, a few seconds or a minute. But eventually you'll see there that text prompt has created images for me there. You can go ahead and click on it. You might have to scroll that. But then you'll see it. You'll see all those new cool uh, football club badges. You can click on it, save it. Uh, you can click open in browser, save it to your device, and then that's how it's done. So leave a like on the video if it helped and subscribe for more helpful videos like this.